Seattle Seahawks are exploring the idea of Geno Atkins, the former Cincinnati Bengals nine-time Pro Bowler. Are the Cowboys exploring it? I've got the answer for you. Mike Fisher reporting from Frisco, home of the Dallas Cowboys, where uh, they put behind them the Saturday night game against Houston, preseason game, get ready to get through Jacksonville after the Tuesday cut-down day, of course, and then really get ready for the NFL regular season opener at Tampa Bay. But uh, there are issues at defensive tackle for Dallas, and so I asked the question of Cowboy officials today here inside the building at the Star, and the answer is no on Geno Atkins. Uh, I'm left assuming that they've already done their examination of the idea, the examination of the idea that uh, the Seahawks are just now starting. Um, Partly age, uh, as Geno Atkins gets into his 30s, maybe. Partly money, maybe the Cowboys already know um, what he's looking for financially and they're not going to go there. But there is no question that the Cowboys need answers at defensive tackle where uh, they lose Gallimore for six weeks, where Carlos Watkins, who was the next man up and listed as the number one defensive tackle on the depth chart on Saturday night, he's got the COVID protocol issue, at least for the moment. Osa, the rookie, is asked to step up. Brent Urban, uh, the journeyman, is asked to step up. Those two guys are probably your week one starters. Uh, And then Bohannon might be the third guy in the rotation. That's not ideal. And so do you examine the idea of Geno Atkins? I certainly do. Uh, And I'm left with the impression that the Cowboys did as well. And I'm left with the impression that the answer is to Geno, just say no. Fish in Frisco with the Cowboys out.